And Lou, if you plan on spending the holidays at the theme parks, pack your masks. Universal's new mask policy went into effect today. Fox 35's Randy Hildreth joins us live from the tourist district. Randy, the theme parks are busy. I see it right behind you. Hey, good afternoon, good evening, and Merry Christmas. We've been here for a few hours and we've seen uh, traffic definitely pick up here at the touristy Icon Park. I talked to some of the guests here. They say they are taking some of these COVID changes in stride. As for that announcement from Universal coming down on Wednesday about the new requirements for masks, and this applies to guests and staff as well. And this is regardless of vaccination status. Masks must be worn in restaurants, hotel, public areas, shops, and on all attractions. The company's says it will continue to monitor the situation and make adjustments as needed. And keep in mind, these changes come as the CDC reported over 31,000 new COVID cases in the state. That new information coming down today, that number breaks the record for the most cases in a single day since the start of the pandemic. You know, we just heard from reporter Dave Puglisi. He mentioned uh, COVID travel. Some of the guests I spoke to today said that they decided to stay close and just drive so they don't have to deal with the headaches of travel and COVID. Do you feel a little bit more comfortable because you're vaccinated? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Just be safe about it. You know, during this whole thing, we've just been trying to make the best, enjoying one another. We both work in professions that we are in contact with people every day. He's a fireman. I'm a police officer down in Miami. So you just have to live life, and that's why we're here. We can't strip it away from our kids because of what's going on in the world. And keep in mind, the mask policy at Universal mirrors what we are seeing at Walt Disney World, where masks are required indoors. Live this, more, live this evening, Randy Hildreth, Fox 35 News. Randy, we know you're used to the mornings. Universal's new policy, as you just mentioned, is similar to the current rule at Disney World. Disney requires anyone age two and up to wear masks in all indoor areas. Meanwhile, SeaWorld and Busch Gardens in Tampa do not require masks. Orange County is getting ready for a COVID testing surge 